Mom, can I please borrow the car so my friends and I can go see a Green Day concert? You're not ready to drive my car. But I've had my license for two months! You just memorized a bunch of facts to get your license. You don't know anything about natural laws like stopping or braking distance or speed or adjusting your speed to the conditions of the road or what about curves and following distance and slowing down? Uh, yellow lights tell me to slow down. What if you get into an accident because your friends are distracting you? You have to take driving seriously. I'll just tell them to be quiet and I'll wear my seatbelt. You have to fully understand everything that I just told you or else you're not allowed to take the car to the Green Bay concert. Green Day! Whatever. Hey Bonnie, what's wrong? <sighs> my mom won't let me borrow the car until I can tell her about stupid yellow lights and I have no idea what I'm going to say. Here, let me explain. While driving, to figure out when to go or stop during a yellow light, you need to estimate the distances, which is the go zone and the stop zone. Here is an example where it shows the yellow light time, the human reaction time, the initial velocity, the acceleration, the width of the intersection, and the, an and the answers for the go zone and the stop zone. If you are within any of those, if you are within 70 meters from to the yellow light, then you are able to go straight through. But if you have more than 70 meters in front of you, then that means you should stop before and not go through the intersection. That is how you determine when to go and when to stop at an, a yellow light intersection. Thanks, Greg. Physics to go. Am I ordering takeout or something? Hey, Bonnie, what's wrong? Oh, nothing, Amy. It's just my mom won't let me borrow the car until I can tell her about following distance, braking distance, total stopping distance, and how they relate to each other. I just learned that in physics. I can help you. Really? Total stopping distance is reaction time plus reaction distance plus braking distance. Reaction time is the mental process time and the movement time. Things that can increase this time are physical distractions such as cell phones or being mentally impaired because of alcohol. The reaction distance is the distance traveled by the car while the driver is responding to a situation. Things that affect your braking distance are your initial velocity and your acceleration. When acceleration goes up, your distance goes down. When your velocity goes up, your distance goes up. If your following distance to another car is too short, and if the car in front of you stops suddenly, then you are very likely to hit the back of the car in front of you because you were not giving yourself enough space or time to react fully before you hit them. Your judgment affects the following distance because you need to think, Am I too close to the car in front of me? Should I slow down slightly so I have a greater following distance? Thanks, Amy. Hey, Bon, what are you so happy about? I almost have all the answers I need to know to get my mom's car. I just need to know the relationship among speed, friction, and the radius of the curve when turning. I can totally help you out with that. All right, the connection between speed, friction, and radius of a curve is simple. Do you remember the bowling ball we had to push around in class? How it would veer off a lot when you tried to push it forward? This is because the centripetal force is always exerted perpendicularly to the direction of motion, which, in this case, of a car moving around a curve, is caused by friction. The force needed to keep anything moving at a constant speed in a circular path is called the centripetal force. In order for the car to be able to make the turn, the frictional force must be less than the centripetal, or it will veer off like the bowling ball. Thanks, Chloe. Mom, I am totally going to that Green Day concert. Really? Prove it. Here, watch this video. So can I have the car keys? Here you go. Yes! Oh, these are to the Volkswagen. Can I have the ones for the BMW? Don't push it.